Like oh. the conditions are never going to be optimal. Right. The conditions are never going to be optimal, but your ability to create energy where there is none, that's how you perform consistently. Right. Because you're always good. Like you never know how you're going to sleep that night. Eight hours may have only been one hour of deep sleep or two hours of REM sleep, or maybe it was four hours and then you feel great. Like right. you, like you, the diet, just inflammation, just weather, barometric pressure, like you never know, right. right? And then so the ability to get yourself in the zone, this is why NLP was so big, is because individuals control how they felt and performed after training on, in an instant, mm -hmm. right? And so like I have to, I have to get myself prepared for a sales call or a speech or a training session through like breathing techniques, like generating energy. Like if you move, stand up, look yeah. big, take some, <laughs> like you can yeah. just, you can, you can, yeah. So like your state is made up of, and like, this is what I think, like, um, your physiology, your focus and your language, right? So like exactly how things are happening, right? And you can control that. You can fo like change where your focus is at. So like if you're focusing on, you know, things outside of what you're actually supposed to be doing, you're never going to be able to create the state that you need to for that action. And then the language, if you're telling yourself that you're not in a state to perform right now, yeah. you're certainly not going to be in a state to perform right now. Right. But if you spend five minutes, two minutes convincing yourself, like if you, if you talk to yourself more than you listen to yourself, you can convince yourself of anything. Uh, interesting. No, because what I would do is, great statement. I have this